Matthew here, bathtubrenew.com, bathtub reglazing, liquid porcelain technologies, and I'm here with the gorgeous Christina as my lab assistant, and she'll be doing some testing on tile. We are putting Hawk Labs and Midwest Chemical Top Coat head to head. Now we're gonna do the scrape test, and then we're gonna do a cross hatch adhesion test on it, and we're gonna see how that pans out. Now we have, on the tiles, we have etched none of the tiles. We have primed them with 4,000 Hawk. Then we have let them sit for 15 minutes. Then we top coated them with either Hawk 4-Hour Cure or Midwest Chemical Top Coat. So we'll see how it pans out. But the things in common with all the tests, all these test panels, they all have Summit Coatings Crosslink on them and Hawk 4000 Prime on all of them. So the only thing that's different is the top coat. So we're gonna put these guys head to head and let's see how we pan out. So let's get testing. All right, so you take two tiles and have at it. See which one, between these two, we'll see which one scrape easier. stuck on there pretty good, isn't it? It is. Don't okay. Go. Try that one. This one tights. Hmm. Well, I've had some people say to me, why aren't you using a brand new razor blade each one? I don't want to use a brand new razor blade actually because I don't want the blade cutting into it. I want to see how it actually scrape off. So. We've done a bunch of testing with the same blade, but if I push hard enough, I can. We, you can tell which one sticks better than the other one. Okay, maybe try this one to see because they're both. Those two are actually really stuck. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this one's way easier. That one's easier. Okay, so put it. Put the number four on it. Try maybe this one and then compare it to this one and we'll start. Get out of here, that one stuck really good too. Okay, so out of these two, which which one which one scraped easier? This one scraped you. Okay, put a three on here. Okay, so we know this one is in last place. I could see how that scraped. It was actually, it was actually still really good. That was very interesting. Okay, so now compare, compare these two now. Okay, so out of these, you still you still think this one is which one has better adhesion hmm. between the two? This one, this one. You think that one's stuck better? Yeah. Okay, so switch it then. I think. Put the put the two on this one. Two on this one. Actually, just run these run these two head to head. Easier than which one? This one. Oh, even easier than number three? Okay, then put number three on that one. So do I compare these two? Yeah, compare those two now.
It's really close, yeah, isn't it? Real close. I'll pick which one. Hmm. One more time. <laughs> this one's easier. Okay. okay. Put the number two on. So there we have our candidates right there. One, two, three, and four. Let's see who number four is. Then we're gonna do our crosshatch adhesion test after this. Number four. Read what number four is. No etch. Crosslink, Hawk Prime, Midwest Chemical Top Coat. If you noticed, it was very similar to number three. Do you think it was close to number three? Yeah, very close to number three. So. What do we got in number three? We got no etch, crosslink, hawk prime, and hawk four hour cure. I think these two were almost pretty much a tie. They were really, really close. Let's see what number two is. Number two, no etch, crosslink, no prime, hawk. And it was almost very difficult to tell between these two. It was, it was incredibly difficult to tell. And this one is no etch, no prime, crosslink, and Midwest. So It almost looks like these two were pretty much tied and with only a pinch of adhesion less were these two. But if we look at this really, really close, you can see the blade only actually scraped off just a portion of it. It actually cut into the prime. And the prime is still there and that blade's actually not that sharp. Same thing with this one. Yeah, same thing with this one. Oh, the prime is actually still still left on it. Will the top coat peel off of it? Yeah, that's peeling. The, that's we're actually cutting into the prime. Yeah, you know, we're just cutting into the prime. It's actually the adhesion is really really good on this on all four of them super good so anybody using these you're not going to have any failures let's do the crosshatch adhesion test now you can see our x and o pattern that we put on everyone There we go. Peel this off. Nothing. Number three. This is, uh, this will be Hawk. This will be No Edge Crosslink Hawk Lab 4000 Prime with. Midwest, nothing, just where I cut it. This is the second one, which one? This one's crosslink only. And I think this was stuck on it. Yeah, crosslink, this is the Hawk Lab 4 Hour Cure. Nothing. And this will be the Midwest Chemical Top Coat with crosslink nothing just where where I cut it with my razor blade adhesion on all of them excellent so if you're using any of these systems on your tubs then it's not going to peel this is not going to come off I didn't pull off any of the squares so there we have it. It almost appears though that every time we put crosslink with any type of top coat, it sticks a little bit better. What do you think? I think so. That's right. You would say it sticks a little bit better. Yeah, it sticks better. Than with the prime. Mm -hmm. Every time on every one that we've tested. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know why it works out that way, but I think what's actually happening 
is I think we're actually cutting into the primer and it's actually not popping off. It's actually not, there's actually no adhesion fail in any of them. They all have great adhesion. There we have it. Matthew and Christina, bathtubrenew.com. We're gonna be doing some more testing. We're gonna put some other ones head to head. But if anybody is using any of these systems that we've used, they're all good, they all pass. You won't have any failure on your tubs. We use these systems on our jobs. We've got some of this stuff out there over 10 years on jobs. They've never failed us and we've done very, very well. Okay, hope this helps anybody has any questions. Wish you guys the best of luck. We'll see you guys on the next video. Bye.